Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Vil again. Um, no snake video this time. I am going to be making a video on how to plant the giant saguaro cactus. And I've got a bajillion seeds in here. I think the buy the uh, seller said there were a hundred and hundred and fifty seeds counted in one sixteenth of a teaspoon, and this is a bag with um, one half. So um, they're very 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 tiny. Let me pour a few out for you. There's a whole bunch in here, so I'm gonna plant them in a few different ways. Um, the seller says to plant in a clay pot uh, with uh, just to allow for better aeration and, and uh, drainage. So I've got this planter here, and they says they say to her name is Kathy. She's from she's a seller off eBay. She, Kathy says to um, cover with plastic wrap. So I'm just going to use this uh, uh, pot bottom here, and it fits perfectly there. My other method is. I have these conveniently, which were um, holding some preserved plums. So I finished the plums. I'm crazy about them. Um, and I made a whole bunch of holes uh, using a, a drill and a tiny little drill bit, bit and along the sides as well. And this will be a perfect greenhouse. And it says that you can transplant these guys once they reach about an inch tall and that'll take about one to two years so what I'm gonna do is and we're removing the um, the I guess greenhouse or the plastic covering after um, after about um, four to six weeks it says keep covered for four to six weeks until you see true leaves um, and then water with distilled water in a spray bottle every 10 days. Um, and we're going to water here too. I didn't get one prepared, so I won't be showing you guys that. Um, keep away from direct sun. Keep in good indirect sunlight and keep in a warm place. The plants will die in direct sunlight. I'm just going to kind of put it in a room on the opposite side of a, an open window and hopefully that will keep it warm enough. Um, it just needs to be warmer than 40 degrees but I guess uh, the warmer the better for this desert plant. Um, yeah, so let's get started. Um, I read from... I saw off another user's... Um, well, this is to plant in one eighth inch hole in the soil one inch apart and um, cover with a pinch of soil. I'm just going to put a layer down, sow the seeds, and then put another layer down, a very thin layer. So I'm not going to go through and count all the... Uh, I've uh, microwaved the um, soil. It's still kind of warm, so it'll kind of help with the germination. Um, I saw off another YouTube uh, so channels another user's channel about microwaving the soil to minimize any bacteria or fungal growth. So let me just... I gotta give credit to him. Let's see. Sorry, bear with me. Well, I've always been interested in saguaro cactuses, so I'm uh, really happy to be getting these seeds and planting them. His name is Cactus Main. That's Cactus, M-A-I-N. And let me find the eBay user that I bought this uh, sag these saguaro seeds from. Um, here we go. Shipped out of Arizona. Uh, her name is Kathy, and her username is uh, Rockbass1. It's R-O-C-B-A-S-S-1. There's no K in that. 
um, she sends um, she sends a follow up email after after you buy the seeds, and she also um, sends this two page instructional sheet. So let's get started. Um, so this is a really shallow tray, but I'm gonna make sure this gets packed in as well as possible. Yeah, the soil's still warm. It's a little cooler on the top, but I'm gonna keep this just lightly packed. And I won't be packing the uh, the coverage of the seeds too much at all. So we'll see which method works better. Um, I'm just going to do some of the seeds now and see where I'm at in four to six weeks. And if I, uh, whatever method works the best, I'll probably go with that for the rest of the seeds. Um, they don't cost too much, but I really don't want to waste the seeds that I already have by dumping them all and having to wait a few more days to get more seeds in. So I went ahead and filled the, the pot, the planting pot. Here's my greenhouse. Here's how it looks like that. So what I'm going to do is just pour a few seeds onto my hands. And this is like, look at how many seeds I have there. And this is, heck, maybe... I don't know, one thirtieth of the amount of seeds in there. So I'm just kind of randomly dropping, but trying to control, kind of going in a grid. Now this seller actually um, harvests these seeds from her backyard. She has a saguaro plant there. So coral cactus. So, I mean, it takes 50 years for them to reach to, I think, grow an arm. This is the Carnea gigantea. I don't know if I pronounced that correctly, but horrible at Latin names of things. Unless I've heard them before, which I have not. Just going to add a few more seeds just to increase my odds I guess and these will grow in a bunch and I can just separate the clusters once they reach um, an inch tall just want to get that in there and now I'm just gonna lightly cover up until the soil hits the brim I'm not going to pat it down or anything. just want to make sure I can't see any. just want to make sure there's no visible seeds. And I kind of want to go for the finer uh, chunks of soil. Because this cactus mix can have a bit of a... Uh, um, it's not ideal to have to just use store-bought cactus mix, but... That's all I have. I don't have any sand or anything like that. I'm just going to take out the big chunks that I just threw in there. I could have sifted this to make it a little more... Uh, there's this drying agent that Cactus Mane hates. Um, so I'm going to toss that out. It's just like a white substance. I'm not sure what it is. So hard to tell if I can see the seeds or not. It's, same th it's the same color as the soil, but it's just a bit. It's kind of a perfect sphere, and it's shiny. So that's what I'm looking for, and that's what I'll be covering up. Holy crap, nine minute long video already. Another 950s. So, 
And these things are tiny when they start off with, when they first start out. All right, hopefully that's enough in terms of a pinch of soil. Well, hopefully it's not too much. So I'm gonna cover with this guy. And I gotta go get my spray bottle ready, but I will spare you guys. So I'll just set that aside and 